All right, everybody, here is question two from the uh, 10 most missed items on chapter seven through nine exam. Uh, this is the concerns about the impact of technology on our lives are growing. There have been recent research reports about the negative impact, blah, 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 blah. They surveyed technology experts and 32% of the experts believe in the future, our lives will be more harmed than helped by digital environment. In an effort to confirm these results, they decided to ask 215 randomly selected customers. I'm assuming their customers are tech experts or else it's not a very good group, I guess, to sample about their opinions. So, all right, well, let's figure out what we know here. So what's the probability that 35 or more people from this sample are concerned about the digital environment? So we will start with the claim proportion, which was 32%. For 0.32. We also know n, the number of people we sampled. In this case, it was 215. And x, which is the number of sample successes, and that's given down to us here in a, is 35. From that, we can calculate our sample proportion, which is just going to be x divided by n. Um, so in order to figure out the probability, we're gonna need our z-score. And in order to find our z-score, we're gonna need the standard error of the proportion. So there's the formula for standard error of the proportion, which is, remember, p is the claim proportion. So this is gonna be the square root of the claim proportion times one times minus the claim proportion over n. So there's our standard error of the proportion. And then once we have that, we can calculate the z-score. Here's the formula for the z-score. Which is going to equal p bar, which is the sample proportion, minus p, which is the claim proportion, over the standard error of the proportion. And then to find the probability, we can just use norm.s.dist for z-score, true. That's going to give us the probability that it's less than that. I guess I should label that probability less. And so to find the probability that it is greater than that, 35 or more people will just be one minus that probability less. Whoops. Rounded to four decimal places, that is one. So the probability is 100% that we're going to get 35 or more people out of our sample of 215 uh, based on this data, if, if this data holds true. What's the probability that 45 or more people from the sample? So now we're going to go 45 or more. We're still in the or more category, so it's 0.9997. Still pretty darn high. All right, so if 56 people in the sample indicate they're concerned about the digital environment, the digital environment, what conclusions can tech company make? Consider a probability of less than 0 0.05 to be small. Select the correct choice below and fill in the answer box to complete your choice. Round to four decimals as needed. So let's see, we're gonna go to an X of 56. That's gonna give us a probability down here uh, of about 3%, 0 0.031, something like that, 0 0.0306, I guess, if we're going to four decimal places. So that's going to be less than our 0 0.05. But we're going to say that this, that these should conclude the results do not support our claim because we found, what, 0 0.0306, 
Oops, I think a zero there, which is less than or equal to 0 0.05. And there we go. So again, hopefully that, that was helpful to you and good luck on the rest of this review and ultimately good luck on the exam.